I'm Dan Morangi, head football coach of St. Joseph Regional High School. We've had a strong offseason, uh, great turnout in the weight room. The summer numbers were, uh, you know, as we expected, uh, great turnout. And uh, a lot of guys looking to work and compete. This offseason saw some changes to the coaching staff and uh, take advantage of some of the talent we have. Uh, we have a great core of, of young guys that are, you know, adding to the mix of the, you know, I call them the grizzled veterans of our senior class uh, that are leading this team. And uh, I'm excited for the future of this program. It is a beautiful evening here in Olney, Maryland, as the 2022 football season is set to begin, as Our Lady of Good Counsel, the Falcons, host St. Joseph Regional here from Dancil Field. But they eat. That's cool right there. Close that door! <laughs> Tell them right now! Alright, I just saw it! I saw it when they came out for pregame for them. They have zero respect for you. The storm is coming, and nothing's stopping us. Tell you that right now, we stick to our knitting, do what we do, play our style of football. They won't know what hit him. Right, the disrespect. They can go through the back door. There's only one way to deal with it. Only one way to deal with it. Punch him right in the mouth and run her ass all game long until they fly the field through the glass. Let's go! Let's go! Boston on the return up to the 25 yard line. Take it, take it, take it. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. You can't get blown across. You gotta get off the ball and in there. Let's go. Even coming out the gate, first play of the game, I caught a hitch, went seven, eight yards. Then second play of the game, Jovan, sophomore, first varsity playing ever, catches the ball, goes 15 yards down the sideline. Then we have Yasin go down for 20 something yards for, you know, like that momentum, that kind of up tempo. We're gonna be pushing, pushing, pushing the pace. That's how we wanna play throughout all season. Okay, they'll hand it off to Yasin Willis. And that's what we're talking about, Willis, as he scores the touchdown. You know, going down that quick and working all summer with this new offense, a lot of us were wondering, like, how is it gonna end up turning out, you know, going down quickly, scoring with the new offense. I think a lot of us got a, a lot of confidence from that, that we put our full faith in Coach Gibbs. We're in this game, like, you know, we were obviously the underdogs in that game 100%, and we drove to feel like we own it. Coach, we're going to eat. We're going to eat today. The difference, boy. Stop playing. He blew it! He blew it up! Down, it is caught and intercepted by Jimmy Joseph. They have gone to that well one too many times. That's number three. Great yes, job. Great job. That's what we're here for. Let's go. They'll try to punch it in to take the lead here to start the second quarter. Hand off. Touchdown! Good counsel. Pepe with Dave Fader. There's the call. Really Communicate close. the call. You've got to get it. Good. Woo! Cut to the outside. And another Pepe Nelson touchdown. Pepe Nelson with his second of the night. It is 20-7. Good counsel. 
Willis breaks tackle. He gets to the next level. He's at the 40. It's a foot race to the 40, and he will be cut down. And he will be down to the 30. Five-yard line. See if they mark him shy of that at the 36. Either way, big gain. I guess in Willis as we're down to the final minute. And it off to Willis, and Willis will score. The draw up the middle, and Willis with his second touchdown. And with two seconds to go here in the quarter, St. Joseph strikes back. New Jersey, baby. We're in this New Jersey football. Forty-six yard field goal. And the bat snap, it goes over the hand of Taylor Warch. And a lucky oh, break. They take it, they take it. Joseph. Draw a hand off to Tucci, and he is gone. I come off the sideline, it's, it's my third carry in the game, and I'm just thinking, do my job, do my job. I see a hole, I hit it, I see open day, I run as fast as I can, and just, it felt amazing when I crossed the goal line. We were the underdogs all game, coming into this game, nobody believed in us. And we showed that we're going to be here, St. Joe's going to be there, all four quarters, we're going to fight, 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 and never give up. Jones in the backfield, he'll break through. Look uh -oh. at him go, Goodbye. getting blocks, good block down the field, 30, 20, give him six, touchdown, good counsel. We tied the game back up and it was three touchdowns in about four or five plays that we let up and uh, the game got a little away, away there, but uh, our kids still competed all the way through the end. The play action, pump fake, Henrich, man wide open, just missed as Donovan McCoy was wide open. Ryan Weaver going deep on the first play. It is caught. Ten five touchdown. Elijah Moore with the exclamation point. Jump, jump, jump. Come on, stay focused. Stay focused. Stay focused. Stay focused. Stay focused. You know, you may look at the scoreboard and say 42-21. You know, I, I gotta be honest with you, I'm pretty proud of you guys for what you did, all right? Because we talked about, I mean, you faced it all night and you kept coming back. You kept coming back, you kept coming back. You know, the frustrating part is gonna see the missed opportunities, okay? I don't think they're 21 points better. I really don't. And I don't think they played 21 points better. I think we, we missed out a couple plays. Offensively, defensively, we missed out a couple opportunities. Okay, that's what you got to grow from week to week and take advantage of those opportunities. We have guys open, we got to hit them. Okay, uh, we got to get lined up right on defense. Okay, we have to make those those plays, those adjustments. All right, but I will tell you, played a pretty damn veteran football team. Okay, with a lot of ability. Okay, and you went you went toe to toe. We got a lot, we're breaking in a lot of new faces. You know, hold your heads high, okay? Be proud of your effort, but understand also we got work to do. We got the Paul Catholic Saturday. Um, you know, we're definitely, you know, biting at the bit because, you know, last year they shut us out 17 nothing. You know, we never forgot that. And, you know, we're definitely going to, you know, go after it this Saturday with them. Going to continue to get better. Um, DePaul's a tremendous football team, well coached. They got a great defense. Um, you know, on offense, they have a system that they believe in and they're going to execute. So, uh, you know, we'll have their hands full. There's no doubt about it. Right on three, family on six. One, two, three. Right. Four, five, six. Family. Family.